Okay, uh, sorry. Okay, the popcorn is done. Darcy, I've got your Sprite and Ocean, here's your Coke. Yes, thank you. He is on the right, and on the left is his sister. And the person with the quizzical brow? That is his good friend, Mr. Darcy. <gasps> That's miserable, poor so Miserable, you may be. Everything okay? Can you not reach the popcorn? What did she just say? You mean, you mean Ruby? What did she just say his name was in the movie? What? This is good friend, Mr. Darcy. <gasps> Why would he do that? What are you talking about? That's my name. Yeah? That's my name. He stole it. He took it from me. That's my name, and he burgled it from me. I mean, that's just his character in the movie. Have you never met someone that has the same name as you? So Matthew McFadden thinks he can steal my name? When he won his Best Supporting Actor Emmy the first year for Succession, everyone was like, huh, that's odd, I thought maybe it'd be like Kieran and Culkin or something, but not me. I was happy for him. Because it's not like he didn't deserve it, it was just like it wasn't expected that year. And now he thinks he can steal my name? And all of you just sat there and watched it happen. I don't think Matthew McFadden has a personal vendetta against you and your name. Oh. I get it now. Get what? You brought me here to embarrass me and then kill me. Oh my god, no we didn't. We're not gonna kill you. We also didn't invite you. You texted us this morning saying we had to come over because you found a new DVD on Craigslist. Oh, now the message is very clear. You're so jealous that I got the Manor Ray shirt and that you got stuck with Dracula, Kitty Cat, and Frankenpug that you invited me here to embarrass me and then kill me. And worst of all, you let Matthew McFadden steal my name. He didn't steal your name. It's just a character he's playing in the movie. And for the last time, we didn't ask for these shirts. You made us wear these. Ocean. You didn't want the shirts? I don't believe it. Believe what? That you would say such awful things about such cool and fun and versatile shirts that I made and to your best friend in the entire world nonetheless? And that's... Me! Of course it's me! Remember when both of you individually said that if you were going to Disneyland and you could only bring one person with you, that you'd bring me? I... I don't remember saying that. Because I lied, okay? Maybe neither of you ever said that if you were going to Disneyland and you could only bring one person with you, that you'd bring me. Yeah, we definitely didn't. But you can't imagine all the stress I'm under right now. Like with all the upkeep costs for my figurines and the skyrocketing prices of tiny, tiny cowboy hats. When did you set those up? Not to mention that Matthew McFadden is trying to steal my identity, just like Melissa McCarthy did in Identity Thief, which is my least favorite movie I've gotten off Craigslist thus far, thanks for asking. And I just really need your support right now, because I can't do this alone. Alright, yeah, sorry, sorry Darcy, do you want to watch another movie then? Yeah, do you have another DVD? Thanks team, I actually just got this new one off Craigslist, it's called Something Borrowed, and I've heard Kate Hudson's great in it. She plays a character named... Darcy. Oh, wait, no, sorry, my bad. She plays a character named Darcy, that's D-A-R-C-Y. My name's D-A-R-C-I-E. Woo! It was a close one, huh, team? Team?